You're watching WMAR 2 News. I'm Jamie Costello. These are your WMAR 2 News top stories. Three firefighters killed in the line of duty, and now their families and one survivor of that fire are suing Baltimore City. On January 24th, 2022, Lieutenants Paul Buttram, Kelsey Sadler, along with firefighters Kenneth Lacayo and John McMaster, entered a burning vacant row home on South Stricker Street. The building collapsed minutes after they went inside. Only McMaster made it out alive. Now a lawsuit claims the city intentionally did not label or list vacant buildings that were structurally unsafe. The suit calls for at least $75,000 in damages. Baltimore City officials have yet to comment on this lawsuit. A candidate for Baltimore mayor drops out. The Rue Vignaraja ended his campaign and endorsed opponent Sheila Dixon. In the most recent Goucher College Baltimore Banner poll in April, Vignaraja was in third place behind Dixon and incumbent mayor Brandon Scott. A senior campaign source for the Scott campaign says the Rue offered his endorsement for Scott if Scott would consider making him police commissioner or CEO of schools. Scott's team declined that offer. You're going to be paying more to park at BWI Thurgood Marshall. The airport is raising rates starting July 1st. It's the first time in 15 years. Here's a look at the changes. Long term goes from 8 to 11. Express goes up 4 bucks to 14 and daily jumps from 12 to 16. The hourly garage will charge a maximum of $30 per day. That is up from $22. You can almost smell the fresh brewed coffee from here. Silver Diner now officially open at the Avenue at White Marsh. It's got all the homey feel of a classic diner and behind the tiled floor and red leather booths is a farm to table fine dining experience. We asked the co-founder and executive chef what his favorite dish is. I love the waivers rancheros, but I also love the new scallops that we have on the menu. So we have a lot of things for everybody. Uh, you know, you can have your French toast, you can have your pancakes and eat them too over here. There you go. The new location is Silver Diner's largest, 145 jobs. Silver Diner also has locations in Columbia, Frederick, and at the airport. Our summer preview continues with temperatures making a run at a record for Thursday. Upper 80s, if we hit 90, we'll tie it. Mainly sunny skies, Friday's pretty good too, but a big temperature drop. And that momentum continues for the weekend. If you're making plants, mid-60s. Showers are around later in the day on Saturday, some scattered storms on Sunday. The weekend's not a washout, but I would factor rain into both those days. Warming up again next week, 70s Monday, 80s Tuesday, Wednesday. We're going to keep this warm May trend going. Jamie? Chris, click with us online at WMAR2news.com all day for updates on top stories and breaking news. Also for news and weather while you're on the go, download the WMAR2news app in the App Store. Thanks for watching. I'm Jamie Costello.